The first thing I'd like you to do is please squeeze your index finger as tight as you can. As you squeeze your index finger, I'd like you to now start breathing through your heart area five seconds in and five seconds out at a pace that feels comfortable for you. We're looking to slow down your breathing and by squeezing your finger, we're helping the emotion of fear move through your body effortlessly. So please continue to hold your index finger, breathe through your heart area five seconds in, five seconds out. As you continue to do this, I want you to understand that fear is only present to let us know that there is a pending threat. Whatever the threat is, it does not belong to you. It is something that happened most likely outside of you and it's impacting you. So it's the outside impacting the inside. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to reestablish the safety within by altering the neurotransmitters that are running through your body and causing you to feel fear or panic. Please continue to breathe through your heart area. You are squeezing your index finger. This fear does not belong to you. It is an external stimulus that is impacting you internally. Whenever you start to feel feelings of fear or panic, I want you to grab your index finger as soon as possible and drop into your heart area, breathing through your heart five seconds in and five seconds out. And before the fear or panic can grip a hold of you, I want you to say, not me, not mine. Fear can only grab you when you allow it to grab you. It can only own you when you give it permission. The next time you feel any fear or panic, please grab your index finger and remember to breathe through your heart area as you say, not me, not mine.